Hey, how's it going everybody? This is Kenema and we're back doing some more Pokemon Go as you can see from the screen. I don't know why I got the little spinning guy up there. Hopefully it goes away. It should go away. Maybe. So anyway, they did another update as you can tell by the title of this video. This is the buddy update. So very, very cool. Um, no, it's not. I don't know. It depends on if you think it's cool or not. Um, they've it's not the update we wanted. We wanted an update on tracking. Uh, get rid of the whole sightings thing that you see, you see here. Um, actually be able to, to go out and back wander and walk. Now when you go out and you walk, you never know if you're actually going to come across anything at all. And it's not really the, the best um, situation. I'm going to adjust my mic a little bit. Um, it's not really kind of the best situation. Because, I mean, do you are you going to catch something? You, you don't know. Um, so unfortunately that loading may cause us some problems, but they went ahead and added this. So now you can kind of come, come in here, go into your, your player menu and you got options down the side and a new one is there is buddy. So you can kind of go in there and select your buddy. And so this time I selected my Gyarados because going off of the last update through the, the, to the analyzer or appraisal update. Um, they basically went ahead and this guy is pretty, pretty badass. I mean, he's got, you know, they, they go through and they say like the impressive qualities and he is pretty good. Uh, so I got him as high as I can at my level, as you can probably tell, I don't know. I'll go back into my, my Pokemon menu and you'll see, uh, I do have like a hundred and something thousand Stardust. So I can kind of upgrade these guys a little bit if I if I need to. So as you can see, the waste the basically with this update is you get to see them on this screen. You get to see a little icon by on the uh, on on the player menu or on on the map. So you can see I got a little Gyarados symbol down there by my my little avatar. So there's a couple of nice things about this is basically as you saw uh, he levels up by total walked so as you walk you get candy um so that does have a, a good chance of you getting that candy that you're missing from your favorite pokemon so and this does require you to find them or at least the base pokemon once then you can start as you're walking now i don't know how they came up with some of the values some of the values are weird we can kind of go over some of those now so 1k so you get the magic carp candy you only have to walk 1k or one kilometer um what 5k comes out to like roughly around three miles so i don't know 1k i'd have to do the math on that but definitely under a mile um so if we looked at more let's let's actually go up here and i haven't actually walked as you see total distance is zero because um haven't really got moved since i got this update uh to download um so let's go ahead and pick snorlax for example so that he is definitely someone i wouldn't actually find out in the wild i know most people only get them from eggs i found two of them this guy and then one that was only like a 700 cp snorlax and not that much but you have to walk 5k um five kilometers so like 3.2 miles or whatever it is <clears throat> to get a piece of candy for him but it's better than not i mean it gives you a little bit more incentive i guess for for walking um so, uh, yeah, I want it gone, but this does give you the opportunity to kind of come down here and let's say you wanted to, uh, where's your, where's my Charmander? Let's say if you didn't have that many Charmander candies and you wanted a new Charmander, Hey, he's now my buddy three kilometers. So it isn't like the magic carp, uh, but this time instead of not getting any of the, uh, the the candies are not catching them so technically though and if you did find one in the wild you get three candies then if you if you already have them and you transfer them and get a fourth candy out of it i guess technically you'd have to walk 12 kilometers i don't know how it goes once you feet uh once you get up there um but if it's just a non-stop three kilometers what about i didn't check pikachu earlier so what about pikachu my highest is like three yeah 337 pikachu is he's probably is he gonna be the same pikachu's now my buddy oh one kilometer so not too bad um kind of like the magic cart so um get that up there and i've already checked some of the stuff and i guess they may maybe would go after rarity 
Um, yeah, let's swap him out. So like Dratini's, uh, those things you figured, I didn't think that they would be that high, but they're actually um, five kilometer up there with Snorlax. And I haven't went through everything yet. So I guess kind of the nice thing is like, you know, if you have any of these pony, Ponyta, um, I think I'm at like 44 candies or something. Technically, if you wanted to go ahead and get those other three candies, I don't know if there is like a... Uh, a disadvantage to switching them out often but if you only needed a couple more candies you know you could switch to that pokemon and go out go for a run go for a walk go for a bike ride um whatever you want to do or do what some people did to hatch their eggs and attach these things to like ceiling phones and, and no i'm not suggesting that if you break your phone it's not on me but some people did do some there's all types of weird creations between putting them on a Rumba vacuum cleaner or Rumba Rumba vacuum cleaner um, to <clears throat> putting them on a train set to putting them on a remote control car or attaching them to your kid or your dog or something. I don't know. A lot of crazy, crazy things out there. So um, we don't want this guy either. I'm going to go back to uh, Charmander just because I wouldn't mind getting him upgraded. So. I think it is a a good update for as far as if you want to get like Growlithe. I, I actually, how much is it for Growlithe? Because I think he I am at like 45 candies for, and that's three kilometers. And I wouldn't mind getting him upgraded, um, because I don't have uh, what was it Alkaline or I forget. It starts with an A. I I don't know all the Pokemon names. And after not not playing this at all growing up, <laughs> I know I'll probably get, you know, murdered for saying that. No. Um, where is he at? They do put little buddy symbols there. So as you can see, he's my buddy. A 552 one would probably be a pretty good one to evolve too. Yeah, I'm at 47. So really I only need three more candies so I can kind of evolve him. And... You know, that would be awesome to kind of get the candies needed, get them evolved. Um, looks like he can actually be powered up quite a bit once I get him evolved as well. Um, yeah, 109,000 Stardust right now. So 110,000 basically. So, uh, so yeah, so pretty good update. It's not the tracking update I know that everybody wants. Unfortunately, I think that Niantic's really suffering because of this i mean from from my understanding they've already last lost millions upon millions of of players but it is what it is so hopefully new things are coming i'm going to keep him up there look at this guy get those three more candies i need but you know i just need to go out and run 12 kilometers i don't see that happening <laughs> anytime soon but we still like i spend a lot of time family time going out to the local zoo to going out to uh um other local areas that have tons and tons of pokey stops i did a couple videos on some good good spots that i stop out stop stop at in uh you know in my hometown but um but yeah so hopefully y'all enjoyed this episode definitely check out the 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 update on the uh, little buddy system if you got it. But this has been Kinema, and I'll talk to you later.